Welcome to 2020. If we haven't met yet, I'm Elizabeth, the Ruthless Crafter, and on my channel, I talk about all things knitting, crochet, and crafts to do with the kids. This year, I have accepted the challenge to do a daily vlog video for you. I'm going to warn you, I'm probably going to be wearing this pink fuzzy house coat quite a bit or my pajamas because my son is outside the door and he likes to play Fortnite and talk with his friends. So I have to do it when he's in bed or before he gets up, which is totally cool because you are worth it, my friend. Hands up if your kids are Fortnite players or Roblox players. Okay, let's talk about New Year's and how we welcomed in the New Year's of 2020, new decade as well as I just can't believe it, but it is here and I'm excited to welcome it. Last night I was with some family friends with my own husband and two kids and it's really cool how sometimes you just have connections with people and your lives parallel. So this couple, it turns out that my friend and I grew up in the same city, different from where we are now, and we were both lifeguards for that city, although I don't think we ever met or if we did meet, we didn't connect. Years later, we worked at the same firm and eventually we were placed in another city at the same client. And we met our husbands around the same time. We moved to the city and bought homes around the same time. I was walking the halls in labor and she was walking out with her little one, both girls. And then our second kids are only 10 weeks apart and the guys share the same birthday while well, they're three days apart. But isn't it interesting how sometimes you find those same people who you keep running into in different parts of your life? Anyhow, so we've decided the past three years to have a annual New Year's Eve tradition where we get together for dinner and play some board games, have some fun, the kids get to reconnect, and they're good friends because they're all close in age and they've known each other since before they were born, essentially. And it's also great when the spouses get along, too. So that is our New Year's, and I wanna know, what did you do? Did you go to a big party? Did you hit the bars? Did you have a family dinner or board game with friends or loved ones? Or did you spend the night in your pajamas and maybe even went to bed before midnight? Drop a comment below and let me know how you spent your New Year's because I would really love to see different ideas maybe that we can incorporate in future years. Happy 2020 and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye.